In Lock Your Data Potential, learn how to create stand tables in Canva that will elevate your presentations and make your data shine. Perfect for students, professionals, and anyone who loves clean, organized videos. So, hey guys, and welcome again in another video where I will show you how you can make a tip with Canva.com. So, first of all, you have just to dive into Canva.com. This is the home page, as you can see. So to get started, you have just to click over sign up and write your email address and your password, then you get started with Canva. So this is it, the home page of Canva. You can first of all select Canva templates, then you choose table here. And then you have just to select all features. I will select here the thing that I want. For example, I will just the free one, then I will click over apply. So this is it. You have here the free one, for example, this one or this one, this one. So I'll select this one and I will click over customize this template. As you can see, I have it here. I will just click over add page right now. Once I do that, it will just here select, for example, this one. And I will click over two points or you can just click over control cup C and you copy it. Then I will just paste this here. Like that. Then I will modificate all these things. Then I'll put it another one here. So we have it like that. Then I will just click or duplicate like that. First of all, I will select the color that I want. For example, I will select this one. The same thing. The same. Then I will add another one. For example, I'll just click for duplicate. And I will put it right like that. Then I will select the color. Select like that. I will select another color, for example, this one or this one. Then I will just duplicate it again. Like that, and they will like or duplicate again. And this is it. Then I will add another one here. But the issue here we have I'll just put it like that so here we have it and right now I will just that so you can see then I will just click over duplicate so here we have another one and I will add another one So here we have here five. Then I will just duplicate this one. I will put it here. Then I will choose the color you want. For example, I will choose this color. Then I will click for duplicate. Duplicate again. And duplicate again. 
we have duplicated the last duplicate in this size. Then I will just click for duplicate and another size like that. Duplicate. Duplicate again. As you can see, here we have it. Right now, I will just write on. So I will choose, for example, the color. I will choose the red one. The color. I mean black. No, for this one, I will choose this one. Then I will. I will choose, for example. So, so I will write here for example names then I will just write here for example days then I will write here for example for example marks Then here we have our right names. For example, here we have Mark. All right, here Bill. All right, here for example, Anna. Then all right, here for example, Selena. Then here we have, for example, for example, Harry. Then here we have days. We have here Monday, then we have Tuesday. Then we have here. Friday then we have here Wednesday then we have here on Saturday about marks I will just write here for example my and they will write eight for Bell seven for Anna then we have 10 for Selena and the last one we have here 6 for Harry so here we have it and I will just delete this one this is my table as you can see then you can just click over share and you're done with making a table so Canva it refers the process by simplifying the process of creating interactive tables, making it accessible for users of all scale levels with easy customization options for layout, colors, and text, you can effectively organize and present your information. Mastering table design in Canva enhances your virtual content, whether for presentations, reports, or personal projects. Happy designing! So, this is it for this video, guys. I hope it has been useful and helpful. See you again in the next video.